Nazi concentration camp badges, primarily triangles, were part of the system of identification in Nazi camps. They were used in the concentration camps in the Nazi-occupied countries to identify the reason the prisoners had been placed there. The triangles were made of fabric and were sewn on jackets and trousers of the prisoners. These mandatory badges of shame had specific meanings indicated by their color and shape. Such emblems helped guards assign tasks to the detainees. For example, a guard at a glance could see if someone were a convicted criminal green patch and thus likely of a tough temperament suitable for capo duty. Someone with an escape suspect mark usually would not be assigned to work squads operating outside the camp fence. Someone wearing an F could be called upon to help translate guards' spoken instructions to a trainload of new arrivals from France. Some historical monuments quote the badge imagery, with the use of a triangle being a sort of visual shorthand to symbolize all camp victims. The modern-day use of a pink triangle emblem to symbolize gay rights is a response to the camp identification patches. Topic. Badge coding system The system of badges varied between the camps and in the later stages of World War II the use of badges dwindled in some camps and became increasingly accidental in others. The following description is based on the badge coding system used before and during the early stages of the war in the Dachau concentration camp, which had one of the more elaborate coding systems. Shape was chosen by analogy with the common triangular road hazard signs in Germany that denote warnings to motorists. Here, a triangle is called inverted because its base is up while one of its angles points down. Topic. Single triangles Red triangle – political prisoners, social democrats, socialists, communists and anarchists, rescuers of Jews, trade unionists, and Freemasons. Green triangle – convicts and criminals often working as capos. Blue triangle – foreign forced laborers and emigrants. Purple triangle – primarily Jehovah's Witnesses over 99% as well as members of other small pacifist religious groups. Pink triangle – primarily homosexual men and those identified as such e.g., bisexual men and trans women as well as sexual offenders including rapists, pedophiles and zoophiles. Black Triangle – People who were deemed asocial elements asocial and work shy arbeitshu, including the following Roma and Sinti gypsies. They wore the Black Triangle with a Z notation for ziguner, meaning gypsy to the right of the triangle's point. Male Romani were later assigned a brown triangle. Female Romani were still deemed asocials as they were stereotyped as petty criminals prostitutes, kidnappers and fortune tellers. Mentally ill and mentally disabled. Their triangles were inscribed with the word blood, meaning stupid. Alcoholics and drug addicts. Vagrants and beggars. Pacifists and conscription resistors. Prostitutes. Some anarchists. Brown triangle, Romani males. Uninverted red triangle, an enemy POW Sonderhafteling, meaning special detainee, a spy or traitor Actionshaftling, meaning activities detainee, or a military deserter or criminal Wehrmachtsingehoriger, meaning service member. People who wore the green and pink triangles were convicted in criminal courts and may have been transferred to the criminal prison systems after the camps were liberated. Some period examples of the single triangle design at Nazi camps Topic. Double triangles Double triangle badges resembled two superimposed triangles forming a Star of David, a Jewish symbol. Red inverted triangle superimposed upon a yellow one representing a Jewish political prisoner. Blue inverted triangle superimposed upon a red one representing foreign forced labor and political prisoner for example, Spanish Republicans in Mauthausen. Green inverted triangle upon a yellow one representing a Jewish habitual criminal Purple inverted triangle superimposed upon a yellow one representing a Jehovah's Witness of Jewish descent Pink inverted triangle superimposed upon a yellow one representing a Jewish sexual offender Black inverted triangle superimposed upon a yellow one representing a social and work shy Jew Voided black inverted triangle superimposed over a yellow triangle representing a Jew convicted of miscegenation and labeled as a Rassenschander race defiler. 
Yellow inverted triangle superimposed over a black triangle representing an Aryan woman convicted of miscegenation and labeled as a Rasenschander race defiler. Like those who wore pink and green triangles, people in the bottom two categories would have been convicted in criminal courts. Some period examples of the double triangle design at Nazi camps. Topic. Distinguishing marks In addition to color coding, non-German prisoners were marked by the first letter of the German name for their home country or ethnic group. Red triangle with a letter, for example, B Belgier, Belgians, E Englander, English, F Franzosen, French, H Hollander, Dutch, I Italianer, Italians, J Jugoslan, Yugoslavs, N Norweger, Norwegian, P Poland, Poles, S Republicanish Spaniard, Republican Spanish, T Czech, Czechs, U Ungarn, Hungarians, or a Z notation next to a black triangle, Ziguner, Gypsy. Polish emigrant laborers originally wore a purple diamond with a yellow backing. A letter P for Poland was cut out in the purple cloth to show the yellow backing beneath. Furthermore, repeat offenders meaning recidivists would receive bars over their stars or triangles, a different color for a different crime. A political prisoner would have a red bar over his, her star or triangle. A professional criminal would have a green bar. A foreign forced laborer would not have a blue bar as their impressment was for the duration of the war, but might have a different colored bar if they were drawn from another pool of inmates. A Jehovah's Witness would have a purple bar. A homosexual or sex offender would have a pink bar. An asocial would have a black bar. Roma and Sindhi gypsies would usually be incarcerated in special subcamps until they died and so would not normally receive a repeat stripe later in the war late 1944 to save cloth Jewish prisoners wore a yellow bar over a regular point down triangle to indicate their status For instance regular Jews would wear a yellow bar over a red triangle while Jewish criminals would wear a yellow bar over a green triangle Topic special marks Many various markings and combinations existed. A prisoner would usually have at least two and possibly more than six. Limited preventative custody detainee or BV was the term for general criminals who wore green triangles with no special marks. They originally were only supposed to be incarcerated at the camp until their term expired and then they would be released. However, when the war began they were confined indefinitely for its duration. Erziehungschaftlinge reformatory inmates wore E or A in large black letters on a white square. They were made up of intellectuals and respected community members who could organize and lead a resistance movement. Suspicious persons picked up in sweeps or stopped at checkpoints. People caught performing conspiratorial activities or acts and inmates who broke work discipline. They were assigned to hard labor for six to eight weeks and were then released. It was hoped that the threat of permanent incarceration at hard labor would deter them from further mischief. Polizeihafteling police inmates, short for Polizeilich Sitcheringsverwarte Hafteling police secure custody inmates, wore either PH in large black letters on a white square or the letter S for Sitcheringsverwarte secure custody on a green triangle. To save expense, some camps had them just wear their civilian clothes without markings. Records used the letter PSV to designate them. They were people awaiting trial by a police court martial or who were already convicted. They were detained in a special jail barracks until they were executed. Some camps assigned Nacht und Nabel night and fog prisoners had them wear two large letters NN in yellow. Soviet prisoners of war assigned to work camps wore two large letters SU for Sojetischer Untermensch, meaning Soviet subhuman in yellow and had vertical stripes painted on their uniforms. They were the few who had not been shot out of hand or died of neglect from untreated wounds, exposure to the elements, or starvation before they could reach a camp. They performed hard labor. Some joined Andrei Vlasov's Liberation Army to fight for the Germans. Labor education detainees wore a white letter A on their black triangle. This stood for Arbeitscheuer work shy person, designating as lazy social undesirables like gypsies, petty criminals e.g. prostitutes and pickpockets, alcoholics, drug addicts and vagrants. They were usually assigned to work at labor camps. Asoziali inmates wore a plain black triangle. 
They were considered either too selfish or deviant to contribute to society or were considered too impaired to support themselves. They were therefore considered a burden. This category included pacifists and conscription resistors, petty or habitual criminals, the mentally ill and the mentally and or physically disabled. They were usually executed or euthanized. The Wehrmacht Strabattalion punishment battalion and SS Bewehrungstrupp probation company were military punishment units. They consisted of Wehrmacht and SS military criminals, SS personnel convicted by an honor court of bad conduct and civilian criminals for which military service was either the assigned punishment or a voluntary replacement of imprisonment. They wore regular uniforms, but were forbidden rank or unit insignia until they had proven themselves in combat. They wore an uninverted point upwards red triangle on their upper sleeves to indicate their status. Most were used for hard labor, special tasks, unwanted dangerous jobs like diffusing landmines or running phone cables or were used as forlorn hopes or cannon fodder. The infamous Derlewanger Brigade was an example of a regular unit created from such personnel. A Strakumpany punishment company was a hard labor unit in the camps. Inmates assigned to it wore a black roundel bordered white under their triangle patch. Prisoners, suspected of attempting to escape, Fluchtverdachtiger wore a red roundel bordered white under their triangle patch. If also assigned to hard labor, they wore the red roundel under their black strakumpany roundel. A prisoner functionary Functionschaftling, or lapo boss, wore a cloth brassard their Kenzeichen, or identifying mark to indicate their status. They served as camp guards barracks clerks Blockschreiber, and the senior prisoners Altesten, meaning elders, at the camp Lageraltester, barracks and room levels of camp organization. They received privileges like bigger and sometimes better food rations, better quarters or even a private room, luxuries like tobacco or alcohol and access to the camp's facilities like the showers or the pool. Failure to please their captors meant demotion and loss of privileges and an almost certain death at the hands of their fellow inmates. Detainees wearing civilian clothing more common later in the war instead of the striped uniforms were often marked with a prominent X on the back. This made for an ersatz prisoner uniform. For permanence, such X's were made with white oil paint, with sewn on cloth strips, or were cut with underlying jacket liner fabric providing the contrasting color. Detainees would be compelled to sew their number and, if applicable, a triangle emblem onto the fronts of such ex-ed clothing. Some period examples of nationality letter marking at Nazi camps Topic. Table of camp inmate markings Topic. Post-war use Triangle motifs appear on many post-war memorials to the victims of the Nazis. Most triangles are plain while some others bear nationality letters. The otherwise potentially puzzling designs are a direct reference to the identification patches used in the camps. On such monuments, typically an inverted point down, base up, triangle especially if red evokes all victims, including also the non-Jewish victims like Slavs, Poles, Communists, Homosexuals, Roma and Sinti see Porajmos, the Handicapped see Action T4, and Soviet POWs. An inverted triangle colored pink would symbolize gay male victims. A non-inverted base down, point up triangle and or a yellow triangle is generally more evocative of the Jewish victims. Some examples of camp triangle emblems on monuments and related uses References Informational notes Citations Bibliography Richard Plant The Pink Triangle, The Nazi War Against Homosexuals. Owl Books. ISBN 0-8050-0600-1. Camp Badge Chart at HistoryPlace.com Additional Camp Badge Chart Topic. External links United States Holocaust Memorial Museum. Classification system in Nazi concentration camps. Stars, triangles and markings. Jewish Virtual Library. Gay prisoners in concentration camps as compared with Jehovah's Witnesses and political prisoners. Rudiger Lautmann